Yeah, welcome back. Coming to the uh, assignment six of introduction to soft computing. Let's see the questions one by one. What property does the domination relation and multi-objective optimization problem exhibit? Transitive. Consider two solutions P and Q for a problem where we want to max minimize two objectives. The solutions with their objective values are P one comma two and Q two comma three. Which of the following statements are true? P dominates Q. Which of the following statements accurately describes the relationship between non-dominant sets and the Pareto optimal sets in multi-objective optimization? The option is B. The non-dominant set is strict subset of the Pareto optimal set. Which of the following is not included in the list of non-Pareto based multi-objective optimization approaches? That is non-dominated sorting based approach NSGA. What does the term middling performance refers to the context of Vega approach, resulting neither very bad nor very good performance? What is the basis of NPGA and its selection scheme? Tournament selection and a Pareto dominance. How does NPGA determine the winner solution in its tournament selection? The solution based on Pareto dominance principle wins. What is the lexographic ordering method in multi-objective optimization? And prairie technique based on the principle of aggregating with ordering. In the context of multi-objective genetic algorithms, Moga, what does fitness sharing refers to? An approach for preventing premature convergence by penalizing solutions that are too similar. What is the significant disadvantage of Vega resulting regarding solution dominance? Solutions are locally non-dominated but not necessarily globally dominated. Now you can submit your answers. If you have any doubts regarding this uh, answers, you can comment in the comment box so that we can have more discussion. Uh, subscribe the channel. Thank you.